Hello everyone and welcome to the Crease Hockey. In my latest video I ranked the EIHL logos. So if you haven't seen that, check it out right here. But basically the reason I did that was because I wanted to dive into my own EIHL jersey concepts, kind of explain what I did, why I did it, and yeah, let's get into it. I'm going to do this very quickly. So first we have the Belfast Giants. I mentioned in the last video that I don't like their colors. So I changed it to what I think would work a lot better in the avalanche colors. So I use blue as the primary color here. I use the burgundy and the silver and the white. And in my opinion, that's a much better color scheme for this team. Next, we have the Cardiff Devils. Now, the one thing I don't like about their jerseys is that they use a lot of green. And I know it's probably because they're a Welsh team and they're using the colors from the Welsh flag, but I decided to substitute the green in for black. Next, we have the Coventry Blaze. Now, this team, I mentioned that the gradient is kind of hard to find what colors to use, so I decided instead of making the stripes an actual gradient, I put a heavy focus on the actual flames from around the dragon, so they surround the number, not just the logo. I also removed the text from the logo because I think it looks a lot cleaner this way. Next, we have the Dundee Stars. So I apologize for the quality of the logo. There isn't really a good quality logo that I could find anywhere. What I did for this jersey is I took the star from the top of the logo and I kind of used it as a separation on the jersey. So the top of the star is blue and the bottom of the star is red. For the Fight Flyers, this is a pretty simple design. One thing that's different about this jersey than some of the other ones is that I put, instead of a shoulder patch, I put their word mark on the sleeve stripe. And I think it fits there better than it would have anywhere else because it's the word mark and not an actual logo. Up next, we have the Glasgow Clan. This jersey is actually my favorite out of all of these jerseys that I made. I love the purple and I love the black. So what I did was I couldn't decide on which color to make the primary color here. So I used a gradient and I think it works. Another thing I did was I took the pattern from the back of the logo I believe it's called the Celtic pattern, but it could be wrong there. And I put it on the sleeve stripes. So on the white sleeve stripes, there's a bit of a Celtic pattern and light gray. It may be hard to see here, but if you really zoom in on the photo, then you'll see it. Next, we have the Guildford Flames. So for this jersey, uh, I thought it would be cool to take the side of the flames from the logo and make it look like the bottom of the jersey is on fire. The the reason I use the word mark on this on this jersey is because I thought it would look kind of weird if I put the flames sideways as well as moving up. I find that it would just look really weird if the G was on the front of the jersey. Next we have the Manchester Storm. So this jersey concept is heavily inspired by the St. Louis Blues. I think it looks good with the purple and gold colors that you see here. And that's basically it for this jersey. Next, we have the Nottingham Panthers. I mentioned in the last video that this logo would be really cool on a jersey because it looks like the Panther is kind of ripping out of a shield. So what I did was I put it on a yellow background, which makes it look like the Panther is ripping out of the jersey. And finally, we have the Sheffield Steelers. So this jersey is another really simple design. It's just, it's primarily black, has a lot of orange in it, and that little gray to make it stand out a little bit more. And that's it for today. Thank you for watching the Crease Hockey. If you like these jersey concepts, follow me on Instagram and, the, and my Twitter. My links will be in the description below. There you can see I started with another series recently where I'm making jerseys for different YouTube channels. So go follow me there if you aren't already. Let me know what you feel about these jerseys in the comments below. And please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.